Hi everyone, welcome. I'm going to show you a beautiful apple dance in Scratch. You see these beautiful apples dancing around. Let's go ahead and see how you can build this. So go ahead and delete the Scratch Cat and go to the Sprite Library and get the apple. So let's first start with the when flag clicked. Let's just say, um, you know, I'm going to use this block that says go to mouse pointer. Okay, so get this block and go ahead and say go to mouse pointer and let's see what happens. So click on the flag and the apple followed the mouse pointer and my mouse pointer is right here, right? So the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to make my apple follow the mouse pointer, okay? The way to do that is you get a forever block and you say always keep going to the mouse pointer, okay? So now if I click the flag, you see the apple just follows the mouse pointer wherever you move it. And right now I have one apple. I'm going to make many apples. So use the clone block and say create clone of myself. Okay. So it follows the mouse pointer and you see there's so many apples because it keeps creating the clones. So the next thing, get the when I st start as a clone block and let's, let's make the clones move. Okay. And let's say get the repeat block and make them do it like 50 times just and then say move 10 steps and then we're going to change color and change size okay so we're going to change color effect you can play around with these numbers i'm going to do three and i'm going to do change size by because i'm making it smaller i'm going to do a negative five okay let's see what happens wow I'm going to delete these clones after some time okay so get the delete clone block and then put it after the repeat so for 50 times the clones are going to move and change size and color and then they'll get deleted i'm going to do another thing if you notice the all the clones were moving in the same direction that's because they start out in the same uh, direction so i'm going to use this point in direction block and i'm going to make each clone point in a different direction okay so you can either use a direction or you can use the random block okay so i'm going to say pick random 0 and 360 so that way it's going to be a good mix so now if we see wow so now all the clones are going in different directions and they are getting smaller changing color and at some point they'll get deleted okay so i'm going to go to the backdrop now and i'm going to just get a nice color you can pick something you like and we are going to just set it to this color okay so now i have my beautiful apple dance animation it's really pretty you can play around with the numbers you can ch change it by different directions colors sizes have fun follow us for more tutorials and other fun stuff